Hi, I'm Ralph. And I'm Vicky from Archer's Choice and the Choice TV shows. We hunt a lot. Oh. We do a lot of outfitted hunts. And when we're in camp, one of the things we get asked Ooh. a lot by other hunters is, how do you tip your guides, your cooks, your camp help? Your camp help? You know, it's, it's an uncomfortable question or situation. And a lot of times, you know, you sit back and go, well, here, it's pretty simple. But here's a real simple way. You go to a restaurant for an hour or two, you pay for your meal, and then you have a standard of 15 to 30%, depending, you know what I mean, on the waiter or waitress. And yet we still struggle with the hunt because we go to a hunt, an outfitter, we pay the outfitter. But don't forget about the guides, the cooks, the ranch hands, anyone who has helped you become more successful or give you a great adventure. I mean, the thing that you need to realize is that a lot of times your guides and your cooks and your camp, your camp helpers, they're on vacation. Oh. They take vacation to make you more successful. This is what they like to do. They're not made, they're not becoming rich becoming because they're guides. No, they, they have the same passion that we do. Absolutely. They want, they want to see you have more success. So what we've always tried to tell everybody is, you know, look at the hunt cost, total cost. And then go about 10% for that guide, whether it's male or female, that helped you for the 5, 7, 12, whatever, 14 days or 21, whatever it is. Or if you want to give them more, give them more because Absolutely. they're making your hunt. And as for your cooks and your camp help, what, 5, 7%? Seven 5, 7%. Seven because remember, they are making your trip, your hunt, as best as it can be. The, the big thing is we're not asking, you know, I mean, no one's made of money. You know what I mean? And if you're, if, if it's hard on you, the thing is, is budget it in there. Right. And the worst thing to do, now you're going to think we're crazy on this. The worst thing to do is after a great hunt, you know, give a guy 20 bucks. Because all that is, to be honest with you, is a slap in the face. Yeah. You'd rather not do that and say, listen, I, I don't have any money. I appreciate everything. Here's my binos or here's something. Do something like that, but go that extra mile because folks, without them, <laughs> it's going to be rough having success.